In this video, I will be demonstrating automated data modeling for Apache Cassandra using KDM tool. KDM automates the entire data modeling process, starting from conceptual data model and ending with a CQL script containing the, the database schema. Uh, the first step in the process is designing a conceptual data model, which I have completed for time's sake. And this is done using the drag and drop interface of uh, KDM. Once that is finished, uh, we move on to the data access patterns. As a use case, I'm going to design a database to support a digital library portal that manages artifacts such as papers and posters that appear in different uh, journals and conferences, different venues, and that can be liked by different users who can uh, like them or review uh, the artifacts by posting reviews. So once we define the conceptual data model, step two is uh, define the data access patterns. I have uh, specified nine different uh, data access patterns here. Um, each tab represents uh, an access pattern. For example, the first one says, uh, find artifacts published in a given venue uh, with a given name after a certain year, and sort the results in descending order based on, based on year. So uh, we have specified this access pattern and uh, eight others. Uh, other access patterns are asking for things like, uh, find users who like a given artifact, find an average rating of a given artifact, uh, find venues that, that a given user liked, find reviews posted by a given user with a rating above X, and so on and so forth. Once we have defined these access patterns, uh, all we need to do is to click on logical and KDM will automatically generate a logical data model. So this right here is a logical data model that was generated automatically by KDM that consists of a multiple uh, table schemas and uh, for example this first one uh, artifacts by venue is accommodating the first access pattern uh, name is a partition key column and year and ID are two clustering key columns uh, year being sorted in descending order because that's what we have requested in the access pattern and uh, authors and keywords are two collection columns denoted by curly braces so sometimes it's possible to accommodate a given access pattern with uh, several alternative uh, table schemas. In that case, KDM will produce a list of such schemas. Uh, for example, here for Q4, uh, we have produced four different schemas uh, KDM has produced. And uh, the solution architect can just choose whichever one he uh, sees uh, more appropriate. Uh, in this case, I'm going to choose this one right here because it has a smaller partition compared to these two, for example, so it's more efficient. And um, uh, plus plus here denotes a counter column uh, so for counting the uh, average rating and uh, here I'm just going to leave it like this once uh, the, the selection has been made we have selected all of our table schemas we are ready to uh, click on physical to move on to step 4 which is configuring physical data model so right here is a physical data model which was generated by KDM automatically from the logical data model uh, this physical data model contains default values of uh, columns and table names and um, and uh, it needs to be configured. Uh, for time's sake, I will only configure this first table here. I will choose uh, integer data type here and uh, integer for uh, for ID and I'm going to change list to a, a set to a list for authors um, and um, uh, and so that's that's my my configuration and uh, uh, I will click on CQL to generate CQL script. Uh, so this script has been generated by KDM and uh, all we need to do is we can uh, configure um, these fields to give it a key space name and uh, we can download the script and uh, run it against Cassandra cluster to create the schema. So to recap, uh, all that's required of user is to define a conceptual data model and a set of access pattern and KDM will automatically produce logical data model. Once that is configured, and uh, our KDM produces physical data model, and then CQL script that can be downloaded. Uh, in this way, KDM streamlines, streamlines and automates the entire data modeling process.